Peer mentorship helps people not feel alone. It's like an accountability. Somebody there for you when you need it most. Helping somebody not reoffend is the key. That's what it's about, helping them not reoffend. After you engage them, how do you get them to buy in? Through my mentor, Clarence Kilber, he motivated me to get into college after pursuing my book. I've been able to do things with myself I possibly wouldn't have done out there. I know I wouldn't have done out there. Mentoring them and helping to facilitate groups is what helped me actually learn a lot about myself. For so many years, I've been part of the problem. Now I'm actually being a part of the solution, right? And the thing is, you know, how big of a footprint can I leave behind for others to follow? What's the legacy here? You guys are thinking about everything you could do in here. Why aren't you guys thinking about what you could do out there? It's a great sense of satisfaction knowing that I'm helping, knowing that I'm, I'm making up for my wrongdoings through the youth. As a former mentee, I'm a mentor now, I'm 26. I definitely offer relatability to the youth. If I see someone that needs help, I'm here to offer them that help. Like, hey, you know, I was in your position before. You could do this with yourself and you could do this with yourself. Just show them a positive direction, you know, and relatability, definitely. It, it definitely, definitely makes a safer community because of the relatability, the conversations that we're able to have with staff, right, to be able to have with other inmates, with the population, it's a, the, the ripple effect.